fact, marriage is a joke. And when I say that, <gasps> it's a joke. Do you know why? Because marriage is a TV show. Yep. Love is blind. 90 Day Fiance. L L L married at first sight. Marriage has become entertainment. It's not, there's no sanctity in it anymore. So when w w the same women that are sitting down to watch Married at First Sight mm. and Love is Blind and 90 Day Fiance, the same women saying, oh yeah, I want to get married. You're literally watching marriage as a TV show. It's not, it, there's no sanctity to it anymore. And so that people can literally say, okay, I've got 90 days to get a visa to, to marry this woman. That's not marriage. Yeah, but so I now, I know all the ladies are going to crucify me in the comments, but really think about this. You guys watch Kim Kardashian's um, 90 Day Marriage, Bad Girls, all this stuff, right? And you're putting this all in your mind and wondering why you view things the way that you do. I stopped watching TV years ago. And if I do watch things, it's anime, Baki, um, movies here and there. But I'm not sitting there soaking up all that negativity. Now, I'm not saying it doesn't exist. But your idea of marriage is tainted because of the things you watch. They're making a mockery of everything. You mean to tell me that Jocelyn and all of them have been getting cheated on for years? You guys are watching that. And then putting that in your head and being like, oh my God, I don't want to be them next. That's why. There are people that are not on social media that are Christian couples living and flourishing, but they're not talked about. Why don't they glamorize couples that are flourishing? Exactly. Because monkey see, monkey do. And the things that you put into your mindset and listen and hear all the time, it's in your subconscious mind, but you guys are not ready for these type of conversations. You know how many times I would sit around women, like I have homegirls and you know, they'll watch little novellas or little crazy shows. And then they'll be like, oh, I, I don't want my boyfriend to be doing that or this and that. And I'm like, look how easy that show made you quick to think that your man's doing the same thing. You weren't thinking that before, but now you're all jealous and celosa for what? See what I mean? Now I'm not saying bad things aren't out there. There aren't men that cheat, things like that. But you're constantly watching negativity and wondering why everything that comes out of your mouth is negativity. Why you don't believe there are good men. Hence why. Why aren't you watching better shows? Why aren't you reading? Why aren't you educating yourself? Why aren't you guys doing things better? I hate that I get ridiculed over this damn loving your man, taking care of your man. But guys, why are you in a marriage if you're not going to do that? Why are you in relationships if you're not going to do the best that you can? Read books, go to therapy, do the self-work. And this is for men and women. I feel like the things that you put into your mindset matter, especially when you get to a certain age. I'm not trying to be 30, 40 years old talking about I hate men. But a lot of you guys are like that, bitter Bettys, and you want to sit like that. You have all the resources now to change your life, yet you probably won't. And look, I'm telling you now, but you don't want to hear the criticism. Stop watching TV for 30 days. Get off of social media for 30 days. Go to the gym. Do better. And I promise you, your life will change. I did it, and I'm the happiest I've ever been. I know women younger than me and older than me, insecure as hell. I don't feel that way, but I can see why y'all do. Do better, ladies.